but you played with Eli, and one of the big debates you hear right now is, is he a Hall of Famer? Your reaction, A, to that debate, and then B, is he a Hall of Famer? I, I think if it's even a debate, it's comical. <laughs> I mean, and I'm not saying that because I have a bias, which I do, but the reason why I'm saying that is, is when you talk about a player who's played 16 seasons for one organization that had started 222 straight games, one at the biggest times and the biggest moments and, and was that clutch player. We always talked about quarterbacks. Well, in order to get in, you need that Super Bowl. Well, he's got two of them. Well, you need that Super Bowl MVP. He has two of them. And I'm going to give you a list of stats. I've been prepared for this since this. I'm going to give you a list of stats about Eli Manning's career. Now, I'm not going to mention Eli's name. After I mention these stats, if you could sit there with a straight face and say this isn't a resume of a Hall of Fame player, I don't know what is. Two-time Super Bowl champ, two-time Super Bowl MVP, eight postseason wins, which are as many as Steve Young, 106 completions in the 2011 postseason are the most in NFL history. He threw for 1,200 yards in 11 in the postseason. He's got five game-winning drives in his postseason career. That's the same amount as Joe Montana, one more than Terry Bradshaw. Four fourth-quarter comebacks in the playoffs, which ties John Elway for the most. 222 consecutive starts, including the playoffs. And he's seventh all-time in passing touchdowns in passing yards. Now, if that's not a Hall of Fame resume, I don't know what is. But all of a sudden, now all of a sudden you put Eli Manning by it. Well, it's a debate. There's no debate when you read stats. Stats aren't about how you feel about a player. It's not about the personal side. It's about numbers and analytics. And those numbers back up a Hall of Fame Well, well everybody wants to talk about big-time players and big-time games. They step up. That's the one thing. I, I was at both of those Super Bowls. Some of the biggest throws that you've ever seen in the big-time game, he made them. He stepped up when you needed him to. And I, to me, there's no debate, Jack. There's no debate. You're, you, you beat – not only that, you beat the Patriots – two times where everybody was talking about, oh, this is the greatest team, especially in the first uh, opportunity. This man deserves to be in the Hall of Fame. Just by what David just said, his stats show he should be there.